and welcome to another CAD Dimensions Tech Tip. I'm Mindy and today we're going to talk about a few things in the SOLIDWORKS Inspection standalone application. We're going to compare drawings, replace an old rev with a new rev, and then update the OCR capture of the changed balloon dimensions. Here I have a rev A drawing of my lightsaber. We'll want to compare this Rev A drawing with the Rev B that we have just received. To do this, we'll go to the Drawing tab and hit Compare. Now we can search for our new Rev B drawing. In the comparison, you can see that there's three different colors. Anything that is red is going to be what's in our original Rev A drawing. Anything that's green is going to be what's on our new comparison Rev B drawing. There's also black, which is what is similar between the two drawings. I like to look at the isometric view. As you can see, it kind of lays out what definitely has changed. Now you can either close out of this application or you can replace the drawing. We'll want to replace the drawing. And then we'll want to make sure we save. You can either save it as a new, the same project or save as a new project. There are a few changes between our Rev A and our Rev B drawing. So we'll want to make sure we go through our balloons and check that our values are correct in our build characteristics table. Balloon number one is highlighted already, and we can see that the OCR capture hasn't changed from rev to rev. So we can move on to balloon number two. Balloon number two has changed, so we'll want to recapture this dimension. To do that, we'll go to our Home tab, Select, Selection Tool. Now we can click and drag our box to recapture that dimension. And last, we'll perform the OCR of the selected region so that our quantity and value update correctly. Make sure to double check these numbers so that the OCR did give you the correct numbers. Now we'll go on to do the rest of the balloon. Number three looks correct. Number four, we'll recapture, just moving ever so slightly. You can always highlight and change the nominal value to make it correct. This one's correct, but the dimension changed, changed spots from rev to rev, so we'll just move that so it's on the right spot. Correct. This one will recapture. That looks good. Again, making sure that we definitely check to make sure our values are right. Once you've finished going through the balloons, make sure you save your project, and you should be good. Thank you for watching another CAD Dimensions Tech Tip. We hope you join us again next time. Don't forget to check us out on YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, and our blog for more great content by clicking on the links in the description below.